George Gibney was a star in Ireland in the 80s and the early 90s. He was an internationally renowned swimming coach at two Olympic Games in 84 and 88. George, we've seen it in the papers recently. You've been offered all these marvellous jobs. You're not going to leave your Irish babies, are you? But Gibney had a dark secret. It was the greatest illusion that was perpetrated in sport ever. There was nothing about that man that was real. George Gibney faced 27 charges of sexual abuse of young swimmers, but never even stood trial. Instead, he vanished. I see somebody, I see a car, I see a face, I see a bird, I see glasses. When I'm not able to run from home, well, what's actually going to happen? This is a story that extends over decades and continents. There were rumours of Gibney on religious trips to Peru, of sightings in Thailand, of him hiding in Scotland. Gibney was apparently hiding in a nearby supermarket before being smuggled in. After not setting foot in Ireland for over 25 years, I retrace the steps across the US. But she's like, hey, Google this. She told me George instead of John. And I'm like, why? And she's like, just Google it. I'm not going to tell you, just Google it. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> So how has he escaped justice for so many years? And where is he now? Do you recognise this guy? No. No. Never heard the name George Gibney before. Is he some bad guy you're looking for? I've spent the past two years trying to find out. Hey, look, look, look. Yeah, that's the boys. That's the two boys. There they are. Just keep your head down. Keep your head down. I think George Gibney's in the front of that car. OK, you ready to do it? Yeah. Where is George Gibney? Available now on BBC Sounds.